Welcome back, everybody. We need to bully some more monsters. Hmm. I also need to capture some more monsters. And grind up a little bit. King Cactus. Is it like a tar pit? All right, let's crank up the speed. Let's try speed attack first. Let's pause. Nope. We need a. Uh, we need a uh, power attacks. Over his claws first. I'm gonna swap to our hammer. Good, heart broken. He's pissed. Um. Let's see. Recovered user HP. Full double swing. Try meteor hammer on your shell. Ow. You're gonna be sad and you place your pookie pookie? Well, you don't have to replace it. You can use it. They'll level and be powerful as you keep going on. You just might get ones that are a bit more powerful or more cooler, but you can keep one the whole time if you want. No rule says you have to switch. Ooh, black pearls. Maybe you're gonna summon uh, Captain Jack Sparrow. Uh, no glorious Brian, I haven't uh, seen that. Gora. So many of these. Dragonite Orb. Royal Rhino. Yeah, you unlock the ability to make monsters more powerful with the gene therapy stuff that you get to do later on. So, you can make Pookie pretty strong. There's probably other monsters that are poison style that uh, may be a little bit stronger just by default, but you should be fine with just anyone you want. No rare spawns, huh? I'm going to go in this cave over here. Uh, Why well, may I do some emotes even in that sub? There's uh, what's called follower emotes. Just by being a follower of a channel, you can use the emote right away. Which is kind of awesome. Mm -hmm. uh, there's follower emotes, which are free to everyone, like uh, Dan Smug and... Dan, uh, Dan Kona and Dan Hat, but uh, other ones like Dan uh, Phone or Dan Sip or uh, subscriber emotes you have to be sub for. But you can buy those with channel points too for a day if you want to.
I don't know what these things are gonna do. Power attacks, okay. We need speed. Trying to get harder. Yeah. Trying to take way more damage. Show me what you can do. Let's try the hammer. I need to stop using red attacks. No better team than a hunter and rider. Uh, Shaitan, thank you for the 10 month resub. Appreciate that. We do have a monster that can help us over there. Let's see what's this way first. I see a chest. Uh, sonic bomb times three. Sonic bombs are probably very good for things that burrow. Like Diablos. To swap to hammer, and then let's do speed attacks. enough to kill him. We're not hurting the animals, we're just farming them for parts, which is not the same thing. I'm sure their parts just detach. It's not like a bad thing at all. <laughs> Remember some Warframe great. stream? Well, Warframe's one of those games that's kind of, it's fun to play, but not as fun to watch. That's why it doesn't do super well on Twitch. So there's a huge population boot up. Uh, player base that plays that game though. It's massive. Judging by today's like stream alone. They had so many people watching, like four hundred thousand. Life powder. Bigger than WoW? Probably not bigger than WoW, but pretty damn big. Probably at least a couple million players with like if maybe half a million that are like super hardcore play every day. The other one and a half million probably play like once in a while because it's free to play, so you can everyone can have an account. Just you don't, not everyone plays all the time.
Roberto, spill the beans. Why did a Plesioth appear in the Barrens? To troll the Alliance? Be patient, and you'll find out soon enough. Does a Plesioth have something to do with the desert? Want to chill it with the questions? The answer is there, if you listen to the monsters. Listen to the monsters? Look, I know they don't actually speak, but it's possible to find out why they came somewhere and what's making them act all weird. If you pay attention to them, is what I'm saying. Old Red could hear the voices of monsters, though. Red? He also liked Who's to drink, that? but I'm sure that's not related. My buddy's grandpa. He was a genius writer, and my friend here has definitely inherited that. Red, I feel like I've heard that name before. What's gotten into you? And what's with that face? Hmm. Hmm? Do you mean like the Red? Er. <laughs> You knew him? No, dude, only the name. He's known amongst hunters as a pretty radical rider. Radical rider. Wowza, buddy! Even hunters know about your grandpa! Yeah! So your Gramps was Red. The far-out rider who could vibe with monsters. <laughs> In that case, you better up your game, kid. Uh, these okay. two these Let's two characters are the answer. awful, but the rest of the voice acting is very good. It's just these two characters are the most annoying accents on the characters. This guy sounds like a surfer for some reason. And then the uh, cat is your companion. He just is the quote-unquote comic relief character that's always hungry. Monsty. All right, let's sneak up on this guy. <laughs> All right, let's do read a check. Oh, they do green. Uh oh. Nah, I don't speak Japanese, so I'm gonna stick with the English. It's our clutch moment, dude. <laughs> Damn hard, I like it. Okay, he hit me very hard. Show me what you can do. Oh, he's doing green attacks, we need red. I don't know what's going on, but my monsters are taking some serious damage right now. Let's ride. And let's get him while he's down. You learn Japanese through watching anime? Really?
Yeah, so far this area, the difficulty has skyrocketed. It is quite brutal. My monsters are getting walloped. I don't know what the level of this area is supposed to be, but maybe I've gone too fast. Hi there. Sorry, don't don't mind me. I wouldn't say you learn Japanese, but you learn to speak some phrases. That anime, but that anime learning is false. Oh, you can't learn from anime. So even if I go ooh woo, that's not that's not Japanese. That's an anime only thing. Coffee cup with a 93 month resub. Thank you so much. Three guns 888. Thank you for the nine month resub and welcome back. Thank you for resubbing. Bet your shiny zennies right here somewhere. Don't you guard down, okay? A shiny zenny. Uh oh. Surprise attack. What? Ow. Case waterway would make the perfect habitat for Plesioth. Check the field. We gotta catch. Okay, we need green. Let's switch to our green monsty. Now get your Dan Bobbles ready. He's gonna do an unstoppable bobble attack and it's gonna be great. He's gonna do unstoppable bobble. Unstoppable bobble 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 bobble. Can't stop it. You can't stop it. Too strong. Um, they're no good. So they use sound to hunt prey. Well, if he uses sound, then let's use our sonic bomb. Oh, yeah. Get him. Broke it. Uh, Roberto is hitting what, like super hard. But he's a hunter, he's supposed to. I don't usually hit way harder than uh, these other guys. Uh, hit him on his back. I'll hit him too. Okay, now he's pissed. He's probably gonna go red. So we need to go speed. Nope, he went, no, oh no, he went green. Ow. None of them. I need red. Let's bring out our Anjanath.
fit his stomach. Okay, it looks like it's hammer time. Okay, we ride. Need another uh, sonic boom. Superwoman. Okay, he's getting a little low on health there. A little trippy. Back to him doing burning thing. Gotcha. No better team than a hunter and rider. Pep top. Nice. Anjanas uh, ultimate uh, kinship tech is very cool. The reason there was a Plesioth in the Barrens was the Cephadrome? Correct, Amundo. The Cephadrome drove the Plesioth out of its territory. In its usual habitat, the Plesioth wouldn't have troubled us. You're making me feel sorry for it. It's the natural order of things. We're all just trying to survive. It's necessary for survival and loot monsters compete for territory dude then they devour one another to satisfy hunger it's just the way it is like it or lump it lump it so they attack each other simply because they want to live right and it's the same with hunters we take down monsters so that humans can survive bro we all take the lives of others to prolong our own. That's deep, bro. That's the truth. And there's no changing it. You just gotta roll with it. It's just my opinion, but I think we stand to gain a lot from cooperating, you know? Riders can bond with monsters. Surely you can groove with fellow humans. Right. Yeah, sure. Why not? Let's work together to solve the mystery of the pits and clear Ratha of suspicion while we're at it. Well, let's head back for now. Come here. Roberto. Hello. Thanks, dude. Sorry I said hunters and riders could never get along. Hey, no worries. It did hurt my feelings a bit, though. Well, as an apology, I could offer you the fine fungus specimen my buddy found earlier. How totally rad of you. Thanks. Seems like you got your gram smarts after all, huh? <laughs> Let's see. Huh? Oh, there's a bug on it! <laughs> right it slipped my mind but roberto gets totally grossed out by bugs <laughs> man that was that cool come on let's hurry back uh this, this queen's a little though. let's get an egg head to their screamers lads let time to uh get wrathy at back 
forgot they took my monsty away. But what are you doing over there, huh? Let's see what eggs we get. Or just probably just one. It's a story one. Yep. Main character's face is still funny. Yeah, well, you can make your own the look of your character. And we made ours look like Dan Derp. Because he's special in his own way. In his own special little way. All right, looks like we're heading back to Lucian, I think. Yeah. Did chat choose it? Uh, no, but I, I I know what chat wants. I can tap into them and see what they want from on the stream. Monsty is a silly name, yes. It's like, what? Let's see what we get from Lunar Luck. I always follow the moon. What will you get? What will it be? Press it, moon. moon. Too bad. A shock trap, thanks. I guess. Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. Oh, you have another quest? Oh, hello. Royal commodities? Actually, turn those in too. Thank you. Uh, thank you, sir. Oh, that's my house. Um... That is the amiibo thing, but you can do it more more often with the, on the Switch with the amiibo than you can with the PC. You just have to wait a day each time. Here, we're gonna level up that guy. The shark. The part. Okay, go do that for me. Dan Nam is perfect. Julie does amazing work. Yes, she does. You tell her to do something, she's like, Doo -doo -doo. done.
Summons of woe. High stakes, duels, fearsome fish. Back to lodge. Hopefully, get our our animal back. We'll see. She was kind if of being mean about reading it. this letter. I believe you may be having doubts about your mission. Ratha is at the lab. Huh? Who's there? You were made commander not for your good judgment, nor for your skills as a scrivener. It was because. You understand the bond between Ryder and Monsty better than any of us. Why do you know where Ratha is? And what's this lab? Where is it? <gasps> is this? Everything will become clear soon. You must hurry. If you find yourself at a crossroads and do not know which way to go, Please, trust yourself, and follow your heart. <clears throat> Urgent news, Commander! There's a monster loose at the lab! <sighs> Lilia! We fixed things up for ya! I... I see. Roberto, you need to go to the lab. The lab? What? Did something happen? I've had a report that a monster has gotten loose. I need you and the other hunters to investigate. Got it. Wait a minute! We proved ourselves! Now give us back Ratha! Ratha isn't here. Right now, he's at the lab. What? What? Roberto, hurry! What about these dudes? Mm. We're cool. You should go with Roberto. Ugh. We'll need you to step in if Ratha loses control. If anyone can stop him, it's you. You're his beloved rider, after all. Yeah. Lilia! And of course we'll need your help too, Naviru. You got it! Just leave it to us! <laughs> huh? Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Guess I'll uh, see you later then. Alright, let's go get back our Ratha, hopefully. Oh, there's a side quest over here. A Garwa egg? A Tomnoserin egg? <laughs> I don't know what that is, but I'll try to get, get you one. We played Final Fantasy XIV probably at some point. It's just not a great game to watch someone else play. So, probably stream in the evenings and stuff. Unless you're like super into it, which most people aren't. But it, it's probably, it'll be a very fun game for me to play for sure though. Palico Pop Quiz, let's see. Blitzmon changes its form when covered in ice. Jade Baroth, nope. Lagombi. Zamatros. Which of these have no effect on Kezu? Flash bomb. A loud noise. I got it first try. I didn't I totally didn't brute force my way through that puzzle. Uh, 
Uh, head to That's the ruins. Great. Thanks. Okay. Kebley horn and immunizer. Thank you. Ancient potion. I'll keep that in mind. Oh, I have fought one of those. You look at our hardwood floors a little bit, yeah. They're looking nice. They're about halfway. They're about almost done with the first floor. I'm gonna do the second floor, uh, probably today. They they probably finished them today, actually. Wait, what day is it? It's it's Saturday. Never mind. <laughs> I thought it was, I didn't print out. Days are like, just blur all together anymore. Sun had just started, or so for some of you guys, Welcome. yes it has. Thank you. <laughs> 7 a.m. What? That's early. How are you up so early on a Sunday? That is impressive. get anxiety on Sunday because they don't have to work on Monday. I think a lot of people are like that. It's hard to relax sometimes Sunday night knowing that you gotta go into work the next day. Friday night's fine. Saturday night's fine, but Sunday it's like, ah, oh, it's just lurking around the corner. You know the boogeyman of work's coming around that corner tomorrow. Welcome. Let's forge. Tiger jaw blade is lovely. Hmm. I need mono blows for that. Very good hammer, too. Tigrex Archer. We got a lot of Tigrex stuff. I need Mono Blows, which I don't know what that is. Thank you. Out of bottle caps. You wish you had anxiety only on Sunday? Oh, I'm sorry. Some of us have anxiety a lot more than we would like.
<laughs> I went to farm that Tigrex in the other zone for some more materials. The weapon's pretty damn good. Let's go for the tail first. He's green to me red. Anjanath, please. Let's try hammer time. Okay, it's not that. Okay, so if he's speed, I'm gonna wait green. I think he's gonna be great. I don't really know. I got a healer, I'm in big trouble. There is a lot of in-game content in this. This game is very, very beefy. It's got tons of stuff to do all the time. We're just warming up. Ow, that hurt a lot. But he's not enraged anymore, so he's probably going to be going... Let me hit him with, uh... And let's go ahead and give him the old pink ball. Okay, he's not capturable. Just get parts from him. Yeah, they're adding more monsters and raids and in-game stuff for this game. Just like they do with the regular Monster Hunter. So there's going to be tons of content. A god bug. What makes him a god bug? It's an awfully important name for a bug. I could better do something amazing. I don't even know what the hell it would do. 